My name is Jonathan Edwards. I'm an assistant professor in the Faculty of Kinesiology. Sport and recreation delivery systems are basically looking at athlete pathways and understanding all the different components that exist within a system, whether that be coaches, officials, organizations, management, any one of those combinations, and understanding what becomes influential in an athlete going from a recreational based activity to an elite level and what are the different key transition points along that pathway. And so how do you keep um, uh, an athlete participating in a sport? By understanding these key transition points, it becomes important for managers to, to say, focus in on those, those key transition points, help them along that pathway. It, it's also used at the elite level for talent identification. I just fit, recently finished a project with a, a number of colleagues from other universities looking at the CFL and uh, the state of the game at the grassroots level and understanding well, the motivations and the experiences of kids at that level and how that can affect the CFL when they're doing marketing and having marketing strategies uh, to attract these people that are already in the game. Some of the other areas I, I'm looking at women's sport, particularly women's hockey, looking at the National Women's Hockey League and, and understanding their creation and how that's affecting the Canadian Women's Hockey League and, uh, and looking at those two leagues and seeing um, is there a disruption occurring within that, that system. The methodology that I would use to look at um, some of these pathways is qualitative in nature. So there's really two approaches that I take. One, uh, interviews. I, I conduct a lot of interviews, I, whether that be with management, whether that be with uh, players, uh, whether that be parents, um, even uh, officials, anything like that. So uh, I tend to gravitate towards interviews. I really enjoy talking to people, so that, that that's the, the qualitative side. The other one is, is basically content analysis. So I look at how the media creates perceptions of some of these pathways or creates the stories around some of these these pathways. I tend to gravitate towards hockey and a lot of my hockey research. I myself and my students that I supervise have gone beyond just hockey. I do a lot of coaching education research. I have a PhD student uh, looking at coach education research, nationally funded for some of that stuff. Um, rugby, uh, rugby pathways for, for athletes. I do have a, a, a wide breadth, but it all comes back to understanding that sports system and the components within that sports system.